On Point Shooting Nation, how are we? Uh, Bud Heaton here. I uh, just wanted to uh, send a quick uh, message to you uh, this afternoon. I was walking, driving through Holiday here, and you can see these, this gate or fence. Uh, it's a little bit of a construction zone. Uh, as I was driving by, uh, they were tearing down some old office buildings. Uh, this red brick building behind me is coming down as well uh, here in the next day or so. And uh, I thought it was interesting to watch. I have a, a really cool clip that I got of the driver of a, of a track hoe um, working his magic. Uh, it was really intriguing uh, to watch as he adjusted and moved around and made the arm swing and, and, and do all that. Now, to some of you who have done that, you know, that may seem like no big deal. Uh, but to me, it was, it was quite fascinating. I've driven a, a skid steer and, and some other, you know, big equipment like that before, uh, but nothing like how he was doing it. He was very fluid and exact and very precise. It was cool to watch. And so I think there's a little bit that we can learn there uh, into our shooting, uh, whether that's in pistol, rifle, or shotgun. Uh, we there's the, one of the key fundamentals in getting good at shooting is mastering the mechanics. Um, if you can master the mechanics, everything else is just then a mental game and, and, and just really being able to improve your performance over and over and over and repeating that process. So when you can take and improve your mechanics and just get those as solid as it gets, just like a track hoe, it has one hydraulic that does, it, does its job and another that does another. And the, the operator inside knows how those all work. Um, and that's us. Uh, we're the operator. We got to know how those controls work and how we can take those and apply them uh, into our shooting. So when you're shooting a crossing target, uh, you know how to set up for that. You, you know, get your speed, uh, lining up with the target, getting online, seeing the target. All of those are mechanics. Um, we don't often think about them when we're actually doing them, or at least we shouldn't be. And so uh, getting our mechanics down so that it's just absolutely solid and fluid, uh, it makes it really, makes our shooting experience much better uh, because those, those uh, mechanics are, are solidly ingrained into our processes of how we go, go about hitting a target or shooting a bullseye, uh, hitting an A zone, uh, you know, whatever it might be in your discipline or your sport, um, or even in your life. Uh, in life, you can do all kinds of different things, and typically there's some function of mechanics to it. Two plus two is four, right? Um, you know, if you, if you tell your kids that something is wrong, they may not learn the first time, but if you can stay consistent with it, uh, that's a mechanic, consistency in, in everything. So uh, say goodbye to the Red Brick Building. This might be the last video ever recorded of it. Um, here I am. So in Salt Lake City, Utah, I appreciate you being here with me. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, or would like to learn more about what I do, uh, email me at coaching at budheaton.com. I'd love to hear from you. Have an awesome day.